Hi everyone, it's Keyless Entry. Uh, today I have a challenge lock. Uh, this one is by Chiz Wizard and it's called Shit Kicker. <laughs> awesome, awesome name, mate. Um, so obviously it's in a kick format. Mummified key and um, got some nice engraving there. Chiz Wizard is a very accomplished picker and seal maker from Australia. So a fellow Aussie. So um, without further ado, let's put it in the vise and try to give it a pick. Alright, so take them out. Dogs, hopefully that doesn't mess with the tail piece. That's still, that still seems free. Alright, so I just purge that up a little bit. So, uh, C4 keyway, so I'll be using a 1.2mm, a little bit of slop, not too much. Um, try counterclockwise and see how I go. Alright. Okay. So, going with my C4 trio with a Tron, Attila, and Lunatic. Seven, did I? No, you're still there. It's good. It's two. I'm not sure about him. Three. Four. Oh, there's one there. Low one there. Crunchy one there. That was five. Six down the back. Okay. Going on two, three, four feels strange. Five, look, just touch six and a slight false set now. Two, oh, a bit more. Look, three. Oh. You're kidding. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Whoa. Um, yeah, that was cool. Um, I have tried to pick this before, um, and I've got nowhere with it for probably 20 minutes, and I just can't believe I've got to open that quick, so <laughs> I'm counting that. <laughs> All righty. Let's see what's in this bugger, eh? Um, the key is taped up, so... Can't lock it back up. And I promise I did not practice that pick. I haven't touched this seat hill in about three, four months. Um, I've got a few to get through actually. Because I had a bit of a break. Alright, tweezers. Let's put these up here. And we'll use a shim. There we go. A bit hard to get through the pins. I think we are through. Okay, keep into that way. All right, there we go. Let's have a look see here. Oh, that pin seems stuck actually. Oh, that's bizarre. Right. Yeah, pin, keep pin two is stuck. Um, okay, we'll investigate that. One. Yeah, two's not going to come out. That's strange. Three is a standard. Four is a torpedo spool thing. Five. Another sort of 
spoofing. Six. There's another one. So a lot of overset traps there. And two. Looks like it's on a bit of an angle. Okay, that just freed it back up. Um, looking at the plug, it might have got caught up on the milling. It's like two layers of undercutting there. Okay, I'll show you the plug in a second. Let's get these drivers out. So I'm not even sure if that would be a valid pick if that was caught up. Um, I think I do recall picking pin two, but anyway. Okay, so one is, oh. okay, Dublin to keep in. Two is like a little gin. Very, very nice. Four is a standard. A spring out. Let's go from the back. Six is another one of those double ended keeping sort of deals. Um, looks like all the springs are the same. Five is another gin, so wow, that's a lot of very um, Asus 700 esque. <laughs> um, let's just see if we got any mods in the Bible chambers. No, they all look standard. And the plug, uh, nothing in one. Two has got two layers of undercutting on both sides. Very nice plane overhead. Big one. <laughs> Three is the same. Look at this two depths of undercutting. Four is standard. Five, we got one layer of undercutting. So if we, yeah, you can see that these here, so this one, that one, and this one, have all got that milling. So very very nice work there and pin placement all right i'll just bring these up to the camera Beautiful work here. So we've got these key pins here, like overset traps in one, four, five, and six. Looks like four was a low lift that had the standard. And we have these funny looking, looks like tapered T pin, double ended um, key pins, I suppose, <laughs> as drivers here in one and six. And then we have these beautiful gin style drivers in two, three, and five. Very sharp lips on all of them. And they would interact with that, that milling, which is quite deep and nicely done there. I honestly can't believe I've got to open that quick. Um, might give this another run because I'm not sure of that. Um, um, number two keeping was sort of uh, jammed in there. So anyway, that was Shit Kicker by Cheers Wizard. Take care.